And in this specific field, Tilde is the player that doesn't let him do that. Mm -hmm. Tilde's pressure being on top of him constantly and these little ways that he's always threatening. Zomba has been put through the grinder, been you know burned one too many times that, ooh, this is, I mean, look what's about to happen here. One hit from Tilde could spell absolute disaster for Zomba. Mm -hmm. And we have seen this matchup time and time again. I don't believe Zomba has taken it yet at a weekly coming from loser side. It's going to be a lot of work, but he's been putting in some serious effort. That last set with Dill. <gasps> oh, no, not oh. going for the forward throw. Wouldn't have gotten the kill. There was time to shake out and it wouldn't have sent far enough. I mean, I, I, I trust, I trust Tilda's judgment for certain. Yeah. And I mean, he ends up getting the kill a moment, a moment afterwards anyway. But I would have liked to have seen it going oh, for that forward throw. And you know, the platform does displace him as well. Mm -hmm. So there's a chance maybe he could have gotten a follow up, even if it's dash attack or something Believe like me, that. I, I wanted to see it too. I was hoping with all my hope that we would see it. Oh. Right. The drag uh, down on that one, not actually getting the second up tilt. He thought the gyro was still going to be there. The gyro had despawned. If the gyro oh. was still there, he would have dragged him down into the gyro for an extra confirm. I see. Very good point on that one. All right, the back here. Being, yeah, and again, you see this, right? Zomba moves away. It's like, okay, cool. I didn't get a conversion. I guess I'll move away. Go back to neutral. Try again. What an angle. There's an answer to your question when we were asking before if uh, Tilda goes straight up. Is the drift available? It is. Oh, the laser into forward smash. Interesting call to try to uh, catch an act of overaggression. Zomba actually looking like... Okay. Very patient on this one. Perhaps even... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> you get... I... It was silence for a moment, and you could hear the wet slaps of Falco's feet on the ground as he walked <laughs> back and forth. That was a yeah. tense moment, and it shows that Tilde is not scared of being patient. That Whoop beat out the forward air. Jeez. All right. That was really smart. Kind of recognizing that Tilde was probably going to pick up that gyro, either, you know, on purpose or by accident, and that forward smash was there to actually, you know, go stop. <laughs> yeah, that back air covered the entire platform. I don't think there's a single tech option that didn't get hit there. Not for too much, though, so only going to go for 15% on this next stop. I think we saw a back air come out at the end of that. Maybe he could have survived if he had done, like, an air dodge or even maybe a jump. Maybe. Hard to say. All right. Ooh. The chase on this one. And once again, this is a big thing that Rob has on a lot of characters, being able to swing out of these combos. But when you've got things like Falco's reflector and the lasers, you can't really do that. And I swear, Tilda only went for an option as risky as he did because he knew that platform was there to help him out on the way back. And in the end, trying to actually punish him, to, uh, Zoma put himself on that platform. And, you know, the turnaround happened. Tilda managed to get the stock. Yep, and honestly, went for the option that covered the most things here. Zomba still having the chance to start the offense on the platforms, but overextending a little bit with that Nair, till they falling down, knowing that the threat of the back air was there. Get back to the ground, and then comes up with and it. And you also saw forward air come out. That was probably frames away from connecting, or at the very least trading, but... Speaking of trading, we're going to oh. bring in the robot to bring out the Roy. Interesting. Have you seen Zomba's Roy before? I don't think I have. I think maybe I saw him playing it in friendlies no a jump. little bit. But no jump. Where are you going? Yep. Up, up. All right. So going to see uh, a bit more of an offensively oriented character. Got the disjoints going for him. Roy, a very strong character in his own right. I'm curious whether Roy will be maybe a little bit more effective at edge guarding. Um, <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I think he'll he'll have just as good a footing, if not maybe even a little better at ledge trapping, but I think edge guarding it's very difficult to beat Rob's uh, disjointed options in the down air and the back air. Okay, man, another one of those up airs. At this point, Zomba is kind of on his last legs, but... Yep, went for the chase on that one, and that's the smart thing to do when you um, pool noodle it a little bit like that. You can chase. And I love that. No, recognizing that he was... That pressure on the shield was too much for him to get a true punish. Went for the jump side B, I believe, in order to get across the uh, the stage and catch that fade back. In the end, you know, Zomba manages to respond pretty quickly, but this is still a lead for Tilde, and I feel like Tilde eventually is going to figure out these Roy habits, just like he figured out the Rob ones, at which point, oh, Zomba's gonna need to adapt mighty quick. Oh no, see, so we saw Tilde bait out the edge guard on that one. Zamba doing a bit of an early up to try to catch it, and then Tilde was there with the punish. All right. 
I will say, it felt like Zomba had learned to not overextend on um, <laughs> uh, Zomba's Rob. And it feels like he's forgotten that lesson against Destroy. So far, he hasn't, you know, hasn't really come back to bite him. But nonetheless, if he goes off stage one too many times, just a little bit too happily, he could die for it. Now, that being said, uh, I think that's probably the only way that... <laughs> All right, went for the... Yep, till they swing in his way out. Got a big lead on this one, so shouldn't be too afraid to do so. Um, and the thing is, is that Zomba has traded Rob for Roy, a character with one of the best recoveries, to one of the most linear. All right, that is a punish. That, is that death? That's death. No. Ooh. Okay, good. Roy Ooh. is heavy. This is a rough place to be. Every hit sends you back off stage, and Roy only has so many options. Oh, but a big up air, big damage. It's very possible that Zomba can take this stock right here, especially considering the fact that Tilda already at 113. If he does that, there is, you know, there are ways that, you know, it could be a lead out, but... Oh, yeah, just, just the way. Yeah, just the patience. Recognizing at that point the fear had been closing in, and that's going to be a 4P, 5P? That's the, that's the that's Zeno 5P. Five five oh, this is, that's like era of dominance. I don't think we can contest that in mm -hmm. the least. There it's... there are dynasties that have lasted less time than 